freaking lake tomahawk over here. <laughs> what you doing over here, Kip? Shut up. <laughs> Bit of a malfunction in the tent. Lake tomahawk in the tent. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> what? What we see when we're in the tent. Take one. This is Kip and scene. <laughs> <laughs> See, it's, you gotta like, I, it's not gonna make sense if you don't see what you're doing. Well, I'm just tossing and turning a bit, you know, it's like... It's this first person. Why does Josh have the higher ground? So I'm a two-stroke rider. I literally can't believe I'm saying this, but it's already day four. <laughs> it is day four of this trip, which is insane. Which means we're halfway through. Isn't that crazy? We're halfway through. No, we're not. Kind of. Five more days for this we, trip. We, true. We've only ridden once, but we're going to ride today, I think. So it has been raining for the last like 30 hours. Not hard, but just like a little bit. Anyway, it's like eight in the morning. But today we're going to be able to ride, which is cool. The owner says the track holds rain like like no problem. And I'm looking at it right now. And you probably can't tell, but it's a little bit shiny out there. You know, a little bit shiny, which is okay. We can handle a little bit shiny. Um, it's a little wet. It's just been raining like crazy. But So here's our idea for today. We're going to make a freaking awesome breakfast right now. And then uh, hopefully by the afternoon, the track should be like decent. And, and what's cool is actually all this rain is... One, gave us yesterday the time to recover from our first day of riding, which I think we all needed. Can we agree? Yep. Yes, we needed that. Kip needs today, too. Kip's back isn't feeling too hot. He's not ready for that four-stroke power. So we're actually really thankful that we didn't ride yesterday just so we could recover and, and feel a little bit better for today. My hands aren't so sore. Uh, my legs are pretty sore still, but good. Josh feels good. good. That means Josh isn't going hard enough. So not true. <laughs> The track is technically closed today, but the owner's letting us ride, which is sweet. So here's what we're gonna do today. Today, we are going to explore Tomahawk. We're gonna throw on the GoPros and we're gonna go all over the place. This place has 110 acres of trails, okay? Which, I mean, this is just, this is a moto playground, this place. So um, we figure the trails are probably gonna be fine because they're in the trees and, and we can ride trails pretty wet. So. We're going to, you know, make breakfast, hang out for a bit, and let it, hopefully let the sun come out. And then we're going to go play around on the trails a little bit and just explore what Tomahawk has to offer. And then uh, we'll hit the track in the afternoon. But this will be your grand tour today of all that Tomahawk has to offer that we know of. <laughs> you excited? How do you, how you think you're going to do on the trails, bro? I think I'll do fine. Just, um, my bike's not exactly used for trails. Well, none of ours are. <laughs> What? Four strokes are fine. Two strokes, I'd blow a plug if I'm not like no, you're careful about, right. about it. Just rip. Coffee. Ooh, so I can breakfast. I'm gonna make a breakfast edit. Let's do that. How'd we do, boys? By we, I mean you guys. Good news, sun came out, so we got all the bikes out and we're gonna go ride the trails. Um, explore, throw on the GoPros and just go explore, but beautiful day. I gotta admit, it's a pretty sweet feeling to like get out of a tent and get our gear on and then go ride dirt bikes. All right, Andy, this is for you. We're taking the trails for you, brother. Oh yeah, a little stretchy stretch.
This is not cool. I don't feel comfortable with this. Dude, that's sketchy. That's pretty deep. It is very deep. I'm not looking to frick up my bike. How are you going to frick up your bike? By dumping it. Well, then don't dump it. I'll see how deep this one is. This is Andy's kind of stuff, not mine. <laughs> Wanna just go back there? What, are they going back? Seriously? Whoa! Oh no. He just don't know how deep these are is the issue. My spidey senses are telling me that's a bad idea. Let's try this direction. Roasted him and now I'm turning around. I get it. It's gnarly. Yeah, I bet it is. Why don't we try the trails up there? That's what I was just about to suggest. It might be different. Or the shot. Dude, this has got to be like right at home for you. This is pretty sweet. Some of the, uh, I can tell I'm gaining on Josh on some of the rocky sections because I'm just like mountain biking. I'm yeah, like, mm -hmm. well, my, my freaking. Yeah, dude. Is <laughs> I'm bru It's brutal. Really? And this is teaching me to squeeze in my knees more than riding on the track. I'm having a blast. This is a lot of fun. I believe the word is uh, basket. Oh my gosh. Oh, basket. That looks like it's going to get hairball. No, the trail's right here. What? what? Are you sure? Yeah. yeah. That looks easier. Watch him go first. That doesn't look like a trail at all. Ah. 
Oh shoot, this is sketchy. Oh man, good thing we're not coming up this. I got water in it. Yeah. What? I'll grab the tools. To do what? It's just a spark plug. No, it's not a spark plug. I got water. It sounded more like a spark plug. I heard gurgling. Well, that's what happens when it. Heck yeah! Let's move! Okay, 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 okay. We did it. Drives it straight into the pond. <laughs> Wanna keep riding trail? Yeah. <laughs> If I didn't have electric start. No! Ah. Dang it! It's so slick. Oh, there's the first crash on the new bike. Uh, how did Kip do this? My gosh. Dude, that last part is a blast. What are you doing? Looking at them sideburns. Dude. This day is going exactly how we wanted it to. Woke up, rode the trails, is awesome, ton of fun. Um, now Chad, the track owner, has been grooming the track all morning and we're gonna go ride freshly groomed it's gonna be a little muddy in spots but not bad i don't think i'm just so excited i like we've never had a track that isn't our own to ourselves
uh, oval for us. He says it's wicked hard, but wicked fun. Josh just turned into a freestyle rider there for a second. Legitimately did a full 180, almost saved it, and then high sided. So you're scared of this ball, huh? What? You're scared of this ball? No, I'm just tired. I think you're scared. Dude, this guy's going ham for that oval for us. Oh, man. oh so he made that corner so much better? Yeah, he did. But dude, it's like, he's doing this for us. I know. Like, we don't deserve this. He's just the nicest dude ever. Hey, the track's already getting better, though. Yeah, yeah. just let that sun get on it for a little bit, and it'll come around. No, it's like, it, that quarter is like night and day better. Thank yeah. you for pushing that out, but. Yeah, that, that'll be good, but I would do like burn in 10 laps one way, then flip it up so you get a nice bank carved. It, that thing is incredible. <laughs> it, it's awesome. AJ's told us about it. He's like, It'll burn you. Oh, it's awesome. <laughs> you just figure out how much you're out of shape because <laughs> you get out here, you got from point A to point B before you lift your leg. Yeah, you can relax. Right there, you got about 30 feet in between, and it, it's like a cardio exercise. Oh, wonderful. So you'll get it. I might <laughs> jump in there with you all too, but Heck yeah. yeah go, go tear it up, man. So you, so you, you're going to go and wait for us to get tired. No, no. Then... <laughs> all right, let's we'll see how this goes. Oh my, wow, this thing is banked up. That's fun. Wow, that is crazy. I want one of these at home. It, it's simple, you know, it, it's totally simple. It's a half pipe. Yep. It's just a half pipe. That's all you got. <laughs> now, wow. We used to have it over there at right where that Komatsu loader was, and it was pretty big. Yeah. Uh, but man, this is this is ideal. I'll, I'll probably dump sand on this half. That white sand will oh, probably nice. get that on there. So. Heck yeah. That stuff's really, that's soft over there. <laughs> it, it's, it's great to fall with. Yeah. this thing
Yeah. How you doing, buddy? I uh, I need ice shoved up my butthole. Oh. So, Josh, so oh. we, let me just explain for a second. This crash, this crash, the crash that you just did happened yesterday. Yeah. The clip that you just saw happened today. <laughs> he did the exact same thing on the exact same jump. But I landed more. And he over jumped it by like 10 feet further this time. Yeah. I'm sorry, dude. Except for yesterday, I knew exactly what happened. Today, I don't even know. I, I, I don't I, know. I was squeezing the bike. For you. I felt good. <laughs> Hit it in attack position. Felt good. All of a sudden, my bike was 10 feet away from me. Oh. Did you let go of the bike before you hit the ground? Oh, yeah. Thank yeah. yeah. Wow. Oh, man. I wouldn't be surprised if it hit that rock sticking out of the ground, because this is like... I don't know if that rock was sticking out of the ground before or after. But, a good point. You witnessed it firsthand. I saw you go off of it. <laughs> saw you go off of it, and then I see him go off it. I'm looking through your phone, and I just see him slowly doing this and then I started to go because I knew he was going. Yeah, you ran quick. Yeah. I'm actively sitting in a lake of hot or cold water. It's probably warm. Hand uh -huh. me a water. So Josh is Just... sitting on ice for the day and we'll update the <laughs> Good good uh good job not uh going straight to the hospital. <laughs> That was a good one. Bro, good one. <laughs> he was supposed to come up the hill. <laughs> what the frick was that? <laughs>